guys, you welcome back to Baldur's Gate. This is Big Potato. Right, what's this then? And half of my party is dead. It's not great. Okay, last time we were in Baragost, um, accepting quests around town, so now we're heading to the temple. I'm on it. Alright, and hopefully revive the rest of my party so we can actually kill someone instead of die horribly. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Is anybody there? Oh, we have to go inside. Okay. Okay, this guy. Right, what's um, this then? Well, hell come. The mm. traveling adventurer is never turned away from a house of Lothander. Okay. So. Oh, yeah. Uh, let me raise my bed first. Yeah, gee, gee, you're a level. Let's see. Okay. Um. Look at bless. Bless is good. A druid fighter. Don't like that bump. Oh well. Just can't be helped right now. Where's her stick? There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. There we go. Alright, she's back and equipped. Now I'm Zara needs his stuff back. Poor guy got butchered. Why is he always the one dying? I don't know. Alright, let me accept this question. Okay. Um, uh, Bacillus, that's one. I like large rewards. Sorted. Okay, let me rest here. Um, wait, did, oh, she doesn't have armor. Shit, forgot to give her. And she doesn't have any arrows. God. Go on then. Right, what's this then? Okay. I'll have to go back to Baragos for a minute to get some arrows for M1. Sorted. Okay, the smithy is right next to us. Alright. I'm on it. Let me talk to this guy. Come on. I can make whatever you wish for a week. Okay, I'm on. Time to get some arrows for you. Um Why can't I buy any? Oh my god. Ah, fuck. Spit it out. I can make this whatever way? you wish for a wee little bit more than me competition. I can make whatever you wish for a wee little bit more than me competition. Why isn't this working? No. All right, this will work. Okay. Um, four. I need eight. better. That was weird though. You I'm on it. Alright, here we go. Now, oh, time to Roll wander the wild head. to find stuff for no reason. It's great fun. 
Find that Bersilis guy and possibly go to High Hedge. Hmm. Let me find a guy called right. Malik Cat or some shit like that. <laughs> That's a good question. Alright. Forget about this. Forget about this. I'm on it. There we go. Oh no, bear! Spin it out. He's broken me. Nature servant awaits. Attack. You train. Uh huh. This is how. Guy here. Hail. It is not often that I come across strangers in this mm. part of the world. That's none of your business. Yes. Okay, I'll just lie to him. I don't need him. I don't need anyone. Hmm. I remember there being gnolls somewhere here. Here. Yeah. What need you get? Servant for the fallen! Stop touching me! <laughs> Stop touching me! No! Yep, I'm Bad. Done. The bad knoll. Oh no. Yeah. Feed him with a club. Feed him to that. South it is. Hmm. Hopefully I'll be able to kill this guy. God, might actually kill me. All this traveling, all this adventure, how do you manage yeah, it? Tough. Until now I was barely able to keep my head above water. Yet here with you it seems almost easy. Keeps death away at night. 
I'm starting to forget why I've thrown in with you. Maybe I should just abandon this whole trip and head back to High Forest. That's me, born and raised in the thicket. At least until my mistakes piled up high enough to come crashing down on me. Well, I guess nobody kicked me out. But they would have if I'd stayed. A maiming or two. You don't count the second degree burn. Completely accidental, and everybody lived. Or at least I'm pretty sure everybody lived. I see. Oh, yes. You really know how to get someone to open up. <laughs> Why, yes, let me just share intimate details about my past. <laughs> I like that. You put me right at ease. During our magical training, we were supposed to summon a sphere of five. And mine got away from me somehow. One moment I was concentrating, the next moment my classmates were rolling on the floor screaming. <laughs> my god, she burned their face off. No, I didn't. Mm. It was my fault. Accident or not, I should have been more careful. I could have taken responsibility or fetched a bucket of water. Instead, I ran away, terrified of what I'd done. Okay. Uh, I agree. Oh well, yeah, if you burn someone's face off, I wouldn't go back and say, how is it going? Terrible idea. <laughs> um. I took to wandering High Forest, but I kept running into the wrong people and doing the wrong thing. Eventually, Turlang the tree and grabbed me and said, take a hike. Well, maybe not in those words exactly. Okay. All right, then I'll yank on your ear when I'm ready to gab some more. Hooray! You I love sister. to hear some stories of people getting their faces burned off. It's just such interesting. Such an interesting tale. All right. Well, let's look for a chicken. I'm sure there's a chicken around here somewhere. Or a wolf. Attack the wolf! That's right, kill it! Kill it with your big sword! That was not a sexual innuendo, by the way. Ah! The chicken! <laughs> Forsooth, methinks. Methinks you are no ordinary talking chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I fear I've taken too many blows to the head. Next, I'll be hearing hamsters speak. <laughs> oh god! Oh god! <laughs> no, I refuse to let this conversation go a step further. No. <laughs> uh, apologies, good uh, chicken. What has caused the current occurrence in state? Hmm. Okay. A misread incantation seems to be the source of his troubling form. Interesting. So he accidentally turned himself into a chicken. <laughs> Some past offense or indiscre indiscretion. Um. Okay. Perhaps, but what shall be our award? It would seem such a spell will be worth much to you with this particular time. Then we shall have to have you restored post haste. <laughs> okay. 
that? Um, his most hated option. Yeah, high hedge. Um, alright. Time to carry a chicken to a wizard's tower. That should be interesting. 